Hello, this is Ike from Spotter Home London, and today we're going to be seeing a four bedroom flat in Mile End. It's going to be East London, and we've got Mile End Station just about a seven minute walk away with the Central as well as the Hammersmith and City Lights. So, with that said, we're going to be seeing all rooms today, so let's go ahead and see them. So, here's the front corridor, and of course, the front door. So now outside of the front door, we can see we've got plenty of flats around us. And then we've got this front patio area here as well. So as we enter through the front door, we've got a corridor with hardwood floor. We've got stairs to the right. Here in front, we've got bedroom number one. The kitchen is around to the left as well as the downstairs toilet. Then here to our right, we've got a closet space. So now as for the toilet, that's going to be the first room. It's around here to the left. And then inside, you can see we've got a sink, a mirror, and then of course the toilet is here in front. So that's in there. This next door will be the kitchen. So now as we enter the kitchen, we've got the countertop space right in front of us. That goes to the right as well as around to the left. You can see it wraps around the wall there. And then we also do have some closet space. So that's in there. And then on this side, we have some more space as well. So as for this kitchen, we've got a dining table here, plenty of cupboard space up above. As for the appliances, we can see here on the counter, we've got the microwave, then we've got the stove here to the right. The oven is going to be underneath that. And then here in the corner, we can see we've got the washing machine. And we can see some of the options we've got there. So now the fridge and freezer is going to be here. The freezer is down below. And that's it for the kitchen. We also do have the window here that overlooks the front. So that's out there, and that's the kitchen. So now as for the first room, bedroom one, because I also see that it's labelled on the door here. This is going to be the larger of the four rooms, and the room also features its own private garden. So now as to the room, here to the left, you can see we've got a desk and chair, as well as storage with the standard iron wardrobes. So we've got two here. And inside, we're gonna have space to hang clothes as well as the shelf up top. So as we look to the right of the room, as we enter through the door, we've got the double bed as well as the chest of drawers. And then we've got one additional chair there as well. Outside in the garden area, we've got this space. We can also see the surrounding buildings as well. So, next we'll head upstairs. Now the first room upstairs is going to be bedroom four. Then we've got bedroom three right next to it. We've got some closet space, bedroom two, and then the bathroom. 
So now bedroom four, we've got a single bed. So to be to the right. And then we've got a nice stand right next to it with a radiator along the wall there. So outside of this window, we're going to see that we've got a similar view from what we saw from downstairs in the garden. And here's a look of the room from this side. So that's bedroom four. As for bedroom three, we've got a slightly larger room. This time we'll have a double bed in the far right corner. Storage in front with the standalone wardrobes as well as a chest of drawers. And then down here to the right we've got a desk. So we've got some built-in storage with the closet here. You can see we've got some space with the shelves. Now inside we've got your standard standalone wardrobe but we've got a rail to hang clothes and then the shelf up top. That's in there. This side is going to be very similar. So that's there. And we can probably get a better look outside of this window to see this side of the flat. And then look from this corner of the room, we'll do it like this. So next, you can see the closet space here in the corridor. So we've got some space in here as well. And on this side, above the stairs. So we've got the final room, bedroom two, we can see the bathroom before that. And in the bathroom we've got the bathtub here to the left, toilet is in front, and then to the right we're going to have the sink. So we can also see that behind the door there we've got a radiator. So that's there also. So finally, bedroom number two. And in this room, we've got a double bed here to the left. In front, we'll have a chest of drawers, so it's a desk and chair. And then we do have some built in storage here in this corner. So that's the storage. Look from this side, and we can also see that we've got a mirror behind the door there. And then the view outside of this window will look like this. So that will in fact conclude it for today's flat. I hope you've enjoyed everything we've seen today. And if you would like to know any more information, make sure to check out spotterhome.com. Bye-bye.